Hello everyone and welcome to Net Crypto where you get important information and news about all coins and tokens of interest and today we are taking a look at another pre-sale Doggo Dodge right is it legit or is it a scam that's the question that we are always trying to answer on this channel right as we educate ourselves against the multitude of scams that have robbed robbed millions and millions of dollars from investors so this one right off the bat one of the things that i want to say or that i like is the fact that they are not using name of another uh, trademarked or patented entity such as xrp as we saw we saw xrp 20 we saw uh ada 20 we saw sonic right so this one they are calling themselves doggo dodge right so kudos at least for them for just using an original name and just having creating their own meme right so now let's get into the project. Let's evaluate whether it's legit or it's a scam. So Doggo Dodge, more than just a fancy meme name. Hello, uh, dog power rents. Uh, dogs make the crypto world better, one paw at a time. Uh, Doggo is a new ultimate meme coin that incorporates a built-in uh, NFTs and its own metaverse. You see, that's a huge boss, metaverse. Is, is actually a huge, huge undertaking, the Dogoverse. So their metaverse is called Dogoverse. Sometimes all of you, sometimes all you need is a second chance because time wasn't ready for the first one. Doggo is a community-driven token that generates immense wealth for the community. Ready for a deep dive on the Doggo Dodge? Remember your research. Woof, woof, right? So this is a meme token, okay, featured in, this is something that um, a lot of uh, projects do, right? Personally, I, I, would, I would actually prefer that a project just actually really puts uh, articles where they are really featured in, right? Uh, because you can pay a website to actually feature your story, like Yahoo Finance, I think it's around $200, Right, and some of these you can just have a press release in some of these websites. They just allow you to pay a fee. For example, I know Bitcoin.com, NewsBitcoin.com allow you. You can pay it's something like thousand five hundred to have a featured post in there. Uh, features press release rather. How do you buy Dogo token in pre-sale? Of course, we all know that. So now moving on, right? Uh, so they're saying step three, right? So what's step one? Uh, install wallet okay that's fine step two claim token once the public uh, pre-sale ends you'll be able to claim your purchase doggo tokens using the claim page right and then um stage one total tokens one billion right so price will be at uh, two zeros two uh, uh total tokens 500 million in stage two price will be uh, two zeros two six and then you see this is also the other thing right that i do not like why is the price why are they changing the price right because there is some sort of scarcity being created here not really scarcity but um rather they are trying to create uh this agency for you to invest into it i understand the commercial side of things if it was a product like i'm, I'm buying a bicycle or i'm buying uh, some other product right hair product or whatever it is right uh, you can create some sort of uh, scarcity around this you know, and I would understand that uh, buy now while it is at this price, you know, I understand that. But when it comes to investment, I don't understand why they have to have a message such as hurry and buy before stage two price increases to this, right? You're not really buying a product. You're just buying tokens. For now, you're buying tokens and a promise of it's going to possibly after they have developed the metaverse, if it is developed, uh, is going to become valuable and then it's going to pump and you can get some capital gains off your investment, right? Uh, so that kind of scarcity in crypto pre-sales, I think it's, it's, it's not something that I would support, but, you know, you let me know what you think down in the, in the description. So what is Dogo token? Multi-utility meme coin, the native token of the Dogo Dogo Dodge ecosystem. Dogo is an ERC uh, token on the Ethereum network and utility token of the Dogoverse. It can be used for both utility of purchase NFTs, participating in uh, game modes, play to earn, and governance. Dogo will have a total supply of 10 billion, 
a Dogo token similar to other altcoins which also has a 10 billion mark supply. Players will be able to convert their Dogo tokens uh, and in-game into uh, any other crypto using the Dogo swap DEX, a decentralized exchange integrated into all Dogo uh, game arenas or choose to hold and uh, stake Dogo stakers are also eligible for extra benefits within the game, right? So there is this uh, Dogo game, uh, the Dogo in the Dogoverse, Dogo game in the Dogoverse, right? That they are planning to, and then there's a the Dogo game in the Dogoverse where you can do Dogo swaps, you know, changing your tokens and stuff, right? So Dogo is an NFT, Dogo uh meta race games dogo is a nft based game uh dog racing game dogo was built on the blockchain to simulate real life racing experiences it brings dogs racing into a futuristic virtual reality the play to end game follows the trend of uh the trend of the new generation meme tokens by using it as a well-defined use case and utility the perfect combination of nfts play to end uh, bread race trade and create a legacy by building a star studded stable of uh, winning race dogs right so one of the things that i want to know when i'm investing into a, a a project such as this one for now it's a promise of what is to come i like the idea right of the of of the promise of the doggo uh metaverse uh doggo game play to earn and all of that. But one thing that I om often see missing in multiple projects is how is income going to be generated, right? So and I, I, that's something that really is lacking that a lot of CEOs of these pre-sales and even those that even attempt to actually make the project, right? To actually develop the metaverse and develop everything is you need to be earning money outside of crypto. Right. Just from a from, for example, if you're going into gaming, right, are you planning to actually launch a game that people can actually buy? Let's say PlayStation. Right. I, I'm yet to see. I'm sure you would know about it. Some of the projects, maybe they are out there. I haven't uh, encountered one, especially these ones that come through pre-sales and crypto and so on, where they actually saying we're building a triple A game that is going to be on PlayStation. Right. And through the money that we are going to be earning, uh, we are going to be putting that money to actually increase the, the value of the token and we've got multiple use cases, utility, and, and so on. I've never really seen projects that actually want to take um, uh, a, 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 a token, right, based game, and actually create a game that they are selling out there, like on PlayStation, Nintendo, and so on. And they bring that revenue into the crypto economy and create tons of utility engagement and so and so on right so far it's just we're just creating these games for people in crypto the people who are buying the dog or token most of them they don't care about playing the game right so who is going to be playing the game that's the thing that's the question mark who is going to be playing the game because you want gamers to play the game and to to end the tokens and so on so you need to create revenue outside of this so that's one thing that i'm really interested to know and also coming to the dogonomics right techonomics there's also one criticism that i have here right is everything else is is great right to see ban 24 percent there's not even a reason for ban to be honest if 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 you just ask me ban is just something that is just became like a trend let's ban tokens there's no need to ban tokens right no need at all to ban tokens um community airdrop dog protection charity sex listing pre-sale and then liquidity you see what is missing there's one thing that is missing transparency around team tokens right we know that you've got this idea it wasn't easy for you to actually come up with the idea everything that you're working on, you need to get paid for it, right? Obviously, you're not going to be buying these tokens as everybody else. You're going to be assigning yourself tokens from the pre-sale. So why not just be transparent from the way to go that so many tokens, right, in the pre-sale are going to be assigned to the CEO, CTO, because I do see there is like a team here. I would prefer to actually see real faces, but... It is what it is, right? So I would like to know how much is the Captain Doggo getting, the dev, the marketing, the design, right? The, the, the moderators in the project, because this project needs money to be, 
it needs income right to to function so how much of that is going to be used what's the business plan how are the numbers looking because when are you actually going to start to make to bring income into the project right when are you going to be bringing income those are some of the questions that you need to be seeing being represented in the techonomics i want to see how much money how many tokens in the pre-sale are going to go to the ceo how many tokens will be going to marketing will be going to moderators will be going to so and what are they investing is there a vesting mechanism right and even if I am an investor, I'm investing in this pre-sale, I would actually prefer for even the tokens that I'm buying in the pre-sale to also have a vesting uh, mechanism. If you don't know what vesting is, vesting basically is you invest into something. You can be an employee or you can be an investor. And for the company to ensure that they retain your services as an employee uh, or a company to ensure that as an investor you actually keep invested with us, they'll say that if you invest up until this time, you're going to have so much shares vest, right? Which means you can now actually uh, withdraw those shares. Or if you're an employee, they say that, okay, we are giving you 100,000. Uh, every year, 25% is going to vest, right? which means 25,000 will vest each and every year, right? That's something that I would like to actually see as part of the techonomics, right? Because most of the projects are just talking about staking. You know, staking is the biggest scam that I've ever seen in crypto right now. There is a place for it, but it's just being used to scam a lot of people. So this is one thing that I would criticize new projects that are starting out. You have a clear distribution of tokens, right? So that everybody knows that the team is receiving so many tokens. As we are buying here in the pre-sale, is the team going to be getting, uh, uh, is their vesting being uh, implemented so that the token price is not saturated from launch day, right? And also, uh, the people who are also buying in the pre-sale ask these investors, is there a vesting mechanism such that we can uh, we can also try to stabilize the price of the token while the utility is being built and so on, right? So that's one thing that I'll criticize, become more transparent here. The lack of transparency here is quite scammy for a lot of projects. That's where you see token dumps occurring, even in projects where people are doxxed, right? I've evaluated tons and tons of uh, tokens. Anyway, I didn't want this video to be extremely long. I can see we're almost above uh, 11 minutes right now. If you're interested in me taking a deeper look into this project, it's a project that you, for me, they've done, at least they've created an original meme. I like their idea, right? It's just a few things that are criticized here and there. And, but uh, for now, uh, I'll just say kudos for them for actually developing a unique meme for themselves. And they are also promising utility. And one of the things before uh, is to actually check the roadmap. That's another thing that I'll criticize here is give us dates, right? We want to keep you accountable. We want to know the dates. When are you going to be starting phase two, phase three, phase four? When is it going to be completed? We need dates right because now they just say we're in phase two and phase three we don't know when these things are going to happen that's one thing that i would like so i don't want this video to be long uh thumbs up to the video by the way on this channel we've got a, a membership program just join the membership if you want to ask me to evaluate a token of your choice join our membership you help the channel uh and and as well you can ask for me to evaluate any token of your choice right uh no obligation you can still ask even if you are not a member right and i uh, can get to it so this is something i wanted to say about this project let me know what do you think right there are some uh, I, I would say for this one right like i always say never invest in the pre-sale golden rule right never invest in the pre-sale you can always invest after launch because the price nine out of ten times is going to drop after the pre-sale ends right that's something that i'll just say there so thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next one.